Hi, uh, my name is Jim Mueller. I'm a developer for University Libraries, and I'm here to talk about Carmen Library Link. What is it? Carmen Library Link is a way for librarians to create specialized content to be delivered within Carmen. All right. So yeah, this is a Carmen course. You can see the library link is in the top left. When the student clicks on it, a pop-up window will pop up, and it will show this. This is an example of a Carmen Library Link. Page. All right. A page can be associated with a college, a department, or a course, so that um, it can specialize the content for the page. Okay, the editor. That's why I'm here. I'm going to show you guys the editor. The purpose of the editor is to create an easy-to-use interface for librarians to create pages, associate the pages with the courses, the departments, and the colleges, and to publish the pages to Carmen. A page is a collection of widgets. A widget is a collection of items. So now a librarian can easily and effectively create specialized, consistent-looking resource web pages with no knowledge of HTML or web design. Pretty cool. All right, the technology, um, we'll come back to this later. It's pretty uh, technical. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to show you guys the editor. Here, I'll make a page. Um, my page. So here's the, here's the page editor, and I can, these are widgets that I've created before. I can just drag those on here. Okay. Um, you know, I can create a new widget if I want. Okay. Drag, a, drag an item on here. Save it. Drag that onto the page. Save. Okay, preview. Now this is a real-time preview. So this is what it, the page will look like when the student clicks on it. So the librarian can really see what it looks like before they send it off to Carmen. So now I'm going to publish it. This will send the XML of the page to Carmen and then they can pull it from their database when they're ready. All right, so to attach a page to a course, that was a pretty generic page, but I'm going to attach it to a mechanical engineering course. So I save it. All right, so it shows up here. And now I can attach this page to it. So now when a student is in Mechanical Engineering 41, they click the library link page, they will get what I just made just now. So it's pretty cool, really easy to use. Um, another cool thing I made was a bookmarklet. So let's drag this up here. So I'm say I'm surfing the web, I'm a librarian. Okay, this is a cool website. I'm going to add it to Carmen Library Link. So I just click this button. Okay, it fills out the information for me. I add a description. <laughs> Save it. Does a JavaScript validation to make sure all the fields are correct. This is a preview of what the item will look like. So I can close that. <coughs> go back to my editor. Edit this page. Um, let's see. Add it to the Find Articles widget. That makes sense, right? So I should have this item way down here. There it is. Drag it over there. OK. Save it. Oh, it noticed that the page is different from when I published it to Carmen. So to fix that, I just publish the page again. So that's, that's the editor. Now let's go back to the technology. We have a little bit of time. Um, everyone that's not technical, you can just stare at the words over there. They might make sense. Um, the, the Carmen Library Link is a, there's a REST API, which is right there on the top of our server, right there. And the editor is just a JavaScript client which communicates with the REST API. The cool thing is now it's a REST API, so we can use that API anywhere else. So the content management system that we're implementing, we can pull in uh, widgets and items directly into the content management system. And uh, you can also see anything uh, I, Google, uh, anything else, we can pull in these items and content, so it's really cool. Um, another thing to mention is, to communicate with Teller, we use SOAP web services, and that's all XML. And this uh, application here handles all of that, and the user doesn't even know anything about it. So it's seamless to the user, and they can create great web pages for resources that uh, they care about, and go directly to the students, and specialized content 
My time up yet? Thank you. <laughs>